What's up, YouTube? So we're saying coming back at you. Not quite sure how well you guys are going to hear me, but I'm here at work and uh, kind of wanted to do a, just a quick video on comparison to uh, from copper to silver or gold. Uh, so basically, you see that one ounce uh, round before one ounce coin. Screws me, dog. This is my pocket piece, and what it is actually resting on is a piece of uh, six inch copper pipe. So to give you a little size comparison, all right, this is a 10 foot stick, six inch copper pipe. All right, so for comparison, it would take two of these six inch round pieces of copper pipe to actually almost equal one ounce of gold. So you can see how tiny that one ounce silver coin is. Right, like I was saying, to take both of these sticks, a six inch copper, to almost equal one ounce of your gold. So, uh, just a little food for thought on that. So this is like the size of my hand, right? <clears throat> and this is the diameter of the copper pipe right there. So just kind of think about that, right? There's that little one ounce silver coin compared to all that copper. We would take all of that copper to equal one ounce, almost one ounce of gold. So I just thought I'd do a quick video on this um, and to kind of keep in mind as well that so for every one foot of this copper pipe is equal to 10.1 pounds, right? Mm. So for every one foot of this copper pipe, six inches in diameter is 10 pounds compared to this one ounce of silver or one ounce of gold, which would be a slightly smaller but more dense, of course. So I just thought I'd do a quick video to show you guys a quick comparison, since I actually had this in front of me, and uh, could show you everybody real quick. So um, that's your copper versus silver and gold, there, guys. So uh, tell me what you think. I mean, that's why I think everybody stack silver and gold and and not uh not copper for sure so all right guys let me know what you think i'll join the next one bye